Hey! Hey guys, what's going on? It's Kevin Escape Skiff. Sorry, I had to do that. I thought it was funny. Um, all right, we got another boat getting ready to roll out the new shop. So we got a Evo V. I'm sure by now you guys understand we redid the Evo V. Um, it is a super bad mamma jamma. Uh, this boat is headed to the Florida Panhandle. It's going to see the tarpon, the fishing. Um, it'll be posted up everywhere. First light. I'm kidding for all the guides that are watching this video up there. But uh, anyways, uh, Weekend Warrior Recreational is going to do a lot of stuff up there in the Panhandle. But uh, Evo V, I'm going to start at the back. We have the 115 Pro XS CT uh, spinning the 23 pitch. Speeds on this are going to be in the low to mid 50s, uh, which is plenty fast. We have the new micro power pole on the back end off the uh, pulling platform mount. We have the removable dive ladder for when he wants to scallop, spearfish, do whatever he wants, sandbar stuff. We have the spider style. This is the shape that we like. We call it that. Then we have the all around light underneath as a directional. We love that feature. Then we have a cup holder and we have uh, the C deck on top. And then we have the removable platform. We have the contrasting cushions in that uh, tan cream color. You guys know I'm color deficient. So uh, cup holders on either side, solid under gunnel, the removable V Marine uh, nylon spools. I love these things. We have the three rod holders on the side angled out. And again, the fit and finish, the screw heads are nice and tight and north and south. We have the grab rail. We have the 12 inch Simrad on it as well. Then we have the sound system on it, uh, which is the wet sounds. And then we have three rod holders going forward and he has one going backwards on each side. And we do that so in case you wanna grab an extra rod and you're in the front, you don't have to walk all the way to the back. Or if you wanna put a gaff, an umbrella, a pole spear or a conventional because you have fly rods going forward. We have the guide mount, trolling motor mount. We've been doing this forever. And this allows the person in the back to see. It also allows you to take your oversized casting platform and put it on the front because we have a tie down. It does not affect the performance of the boat. Then we have the base uh, Ramlin upgrade aluminum trailer with the uh, swing tongue because he's going to keep it inside. Then we have a cleat on the other side as well. We always have a train, a car, or a plane going by when we talk. But I say it all the time, guys. There's a lot of good boats out there and there's a lot of good choices in today's market, but it's really hard to beat us. Um, this gentleman has wanted this boat for a while and I'm just glad to see it come together for him. Uh, I love the color contrast. We also did a little throwback decal forms, what he wanted. Um, Chris, I hope you love it, brother. I can't wait to see the fish as you bring boat side. Um, to all you guys out there, I would just want to say thank you. We got a lot more boats coming uh, and going. So y'all take care. See ya.